Welcome to the Kareem Report, a.k.a. Mr. 100 Likes. How you guys doing? Wow. Let's get to it. Let's get to it, man. YouTube has solved the murder of Takeoff. The Migos rapper Takeoff. They, they solved the uh, murder. Man, it's crazy how, you know, these guys, it's a lot of guys on YouTube been breaking this stuff down with the slow motion and, 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 it is amazing what these guys doing like this is not a shot against them i'm not trying to you know throw no shot nothing against them but it's just crazy how saying dj got academic this is a lot of guys i ain't gonna call any one particular person out but it's a lot it's a lot of video on it how these guys breaking down the case and and it's crazy i tell people that um when it's something that you passionate about, something you want to do, you can get it done. You can get it done. And um, this definitely shows it how, you know, you have a lot of talented people, you know, good at what they what they do. And like, man, see, that's why I, I have me personally, I have limitations, a lot of limitations on, on YouTube. Because some of the stuff I just don't do, a lot of stuff I don't talk about, I'm... I'm I watch it like I like I tell you the drill culture. I'm I'm watch it. I, I invest. I pretty much know a lot what's going on. I can't say I know a lot personally because we all don't. A lot of these stories, a lot of times, you know, be exaggerated. But I follow the drill culture, the Chicago drill, and um, I don't talk much about it because I just don't be feeling comfortable saying, "Oh, this person supposed to kill this person." I I just. For life, man, I just can't can't do that. There's some stuff I just can't do, and um, but kudos to the people who doing it and and they channels is is you know they doing the damn thing, you know what I'm saying? But um, yeah, it's crazy how you know you just follow it and then you sit back and watch it play out and then it come out exactly how the police breaks it down exactly how you see what happened on YouTube. And I saw this not just with this case, with a lot of cases. And like I said, it, it, it's it's crazy how how that shit is. Like, um, yeah, but it, it, to the end of the day, and, and and this one thing I'm gonna say about this, like I said, I didn't only make. I pretty much always make like one video about when a rapper somebody die, and that be it. And I've told a lot of people behind the scenes like people who I see it's who I speak to on a personal level the first thing I said when I saw the video I said I don't think that um Quavo was arguing with uh, a, a, a one of this a regular entrepreneur Raj type of dude I said and I called I said I think he was arguing with, with um Prince or somebody it it had to be somebody either, I mean, a right-hand man or Jay Prince or, or, or Jay Prince Jr. I said that because the way Quavo and the argument, I don't see him just, unless he really locked in with a lot of the guys, you don't just argue with with um, people randomly. You wouldn't even waste your time. You don't know these dudes like that. I said, it's somebody he know, no. And then, and reason why I felt he's arguing with with, with, with J Prince or Jadge, whichever one of them it is, but one of the, the sons, because the way how the argument kept, you know, going. Normally, if it wasn't J Prince or none of them guys, that you normally step in like yeah, she ain't about nothing. Once you see it get in a certain place, and, and that's not your man. On this, how things works. Let's say Quavo. The Migos is is there with with the Prince, right? They there with, with with the uh the Prince boys, right? They there with them. So anything him arguing anything outside of them, normally one of the Prince boys step in and and and, and be like, no, leave that shit alone. You didn't hear nobody say leave it alone. It's just going back and forth arguing, and you could see it's getting intense the way, you know. You hear the argument, you see it's getting tense, and, and before you even get the let's just say, let's say if it was no guns drawn, fighting or somebody say suck my dick, 
like when the words now when the words get like that like cause that's always with this area suck my dick fuck bitch ass nigga when words start getting a little more intense you always step in if you see it and stop it so when I seen I said I think he arguing with one of, one of the prince um or uh, one of the right hand man not no just random type of dude because I believe one of the uh the sons would have stepped in and be like yo leave that shit you ain't hear nobody say nothing like Yo, leave that shit alone. That shit ain't about nothing. You ain't hear that. So I said it had to be somebody that's kind of on a, on a level going back and forth. I said that, but I, I'm not going to sit there and go and be on YouTube. Yo, I think it was this. But now that's coming out that he's arguing with um, uh, Jay Prince Jr. And and, and I, I, I felt that I, I, I felt that vibe how I was soon as I I saw that part of the the, um, the video, cause you just know right away, you know what I mean. The level when when people just don't say nothing when it's in the cut, like that's they man. So they gonna let if people they not gonna say nothing. They gonna let them rock. I felt that right then and, then, and that's how them argument and that I, I felt it and, and it's crazy. It shouldn't that just why you still at the end of the day have to have your own mind and you want people. I'm not saying them dudes don't have their own mind. I'm not saying that. But regardless of what, whoever, somebody should have came in, stepped in, be like, yo, this ain't about nothing. I ain't hear nobody say nothing. The argument, you can see when stuff start getting tense, you have to nip certain things in the bud early before a one, or it takes one disrespectful word that, that where it makes somebody even swing on. Let, let us forget guns. Oh, you say something like, oh, we fighting. Now we get to a, a fighting word. Put it that way, fighting words. Or take a fighting word. And then when you're dealing with two large crews, it, it, it can go up from there. So to avoid all that, that's why I take off said what he said. Yo, let me leave before I hurt somebody. Because it, it, it's getting there. Because you you know the uh, lane that is going. So, um... Yeah, it's, it, it, it's crazy, man. Sad that this man lost his life over that, man. Over an argument, something that happened. And like I said, be so quick to kill. Like, you know, that, that shouldn't even be you partying with around these guys all day. And then that fast? That That's just why it's just, it's just so crazy, man. But um, rest in peace, take off, man. And your family, man. I, I could imagine, man. You got to fly to another state. You know, that... that you know what I mean? And like, man, this is crazy, man.